Hello, it's Lee here. I saw Joanna Jean Creations making these awesome junk journal embellishments. So I thought I would have a try at making these. So if you want to see where I got my inspiration from, there's a link for Joanna Jean Creations video in my video description box. Thanks for joining me. If you love pairing with paint and paper and glue and scissors, inks and all other enjoyable crafty things, I think we're going to have some fun today. Um, we'll collage right. with some scraps to start with. Cover a few pieces of paper, then do some other things on top of it and turn them into junk journal embellishments. Alright, so I just found a box that said scrap paper on the outside of it but when I opened it up there was all sorts of things in it so I grabbed a few things out of there firstly I'm going to take my first piece of paper and glue down completely cover it in scraps so I've got things like this where I've printed off one of my digital kits but then I've used the other side to do a jelly print or a roll off or something by the look of that. Same with that one. I think these might make for some interesting backgrounds to uh, use as my base. And I'm just using this PVA glue so I'm going to get cracking and paste some strips of paper on here. not thinking about um, any sort of composition or anything here I just my aim is just to cover that completely so I'm going to put bigger pieces down to begin with and then smaller pieces over the top By the time I finish gluing everything down, the paper is going to be probably three layers thick. So the original paper, this first layer, and then the small pieces that get stuck over the top. This one I'm going to try and keep it a bit brighter. And then I've got some neutral papers that I thought I might use on another one. See how they turn out. It's nice. I don't go so much for the with love on there, but um, it'll probably get covered over anyway. pieces down randomly. that were in that box so as I say <laughs> there's no it wasn't paper scraps there was all sorts of stuff in there
going to let that dry and then I'm going to use some gelatos and water soluble crayon to put some extra accents on that
you've enjoyed this video and that you've got some ideas of how you can uh, make some really awesome journal embellishments. Um, this was made from just three base papers. Um, two were A4 and one was a little bit bigger because it was a page out of a book. Um, you can decorate them up as much as you want. And these ones are quite bright so I think I might make another video and do some that are a little bit more toned down than these ones but uh, a little bit more neutral suited to vintage uh, you know vintage junk journal but um, these certainly delightful fun to make so relaxing <laughs> it was basically like you're just putting anything onto the paper and it all it all works out like it, it, after a while it starts looking a little bit like a big uh, mess but um, yeah it turns out all right in the end so some of them I left without uh, putting anything on the back of them. Others, well that one that you can see there, it's got a um, book page behind it. So it's got text on there. But the ones that were plain, a lot of them I just stamped some text onto and inked around them. And then some I just left the way they were. Don't forget to check out the video link in my description box to see where I got my inspiration from for these beautiful little t uh, embellishments. See you in the next video. Cheers from Australia. Hooroo.